Oh, oh, hello there. Didn't bring a jewel leak. We're back. One more game tonight. One more best of three. And this should be the best of the lot. Uh, we are going to have two heavyweights. One in the form of Reki, exceptionally experienced in Doombringer. Fantastic tournament player we saw earlier. Um, and, and Strong Say, true. Such a strong player in other games. Uh, expecting great things from him as the Doombringer Duel League progresses. And uh, yeah, this is really our first look at, you know, Strong Say draft for a little bit of practice. Week two. Has some more games under his belt. And we've got Reki in fine form as well. Uh, this could go either way. I'm expecting both mechanically to to terrify us all um map knowledge strategically you've got to like it for recce you've got to favor his experience but you know strong sage is he's a special guy he really is and we're going to talk a little bit about his exploits here uh so this is someone that inquake champions has reached over 2500 sr has beaten the likes of zanaku bay cypher razy um you know he's absolutely top tier in that game and that is as much as we love the doombringer julies that is the the creme de la creme of arena fps at the moment uh his next fixtures we've got recce sixy and yup i think that's a really interesting mix um recce very very tough yup is new like strong sage and also very good at quake champions and they actually play each other in that game as well so watch out for that one really excited for it hopefully we'll be getting onto that fairly soon and on the other side it is of course recce master of the rec tech net code we saw him earlier in fine form, in tournament shape, uh, one of the best players in the world bar none. And uh, I think the players are ready, and I'm ready, and you're ready. Let's get it on, it's your four. Here we are then. I'm on board with Strong Sage of MCS Gaming. Go give those guys and all of the players a follow on Twitter if you are so interested. They're pretty easy to find by their tags. Strong Sage will not be super familiar with Duel 4, as it is a Doombringer original. He lands quickly and he hits very hard, but Reki up close with the shotgun is gonna start things off well. Big ups, Rob. Core V2 of Shaftastic TV. Fantastic Quake Champions caster and does a lot for the community. So far, so good for Reki. Strong Sage tries to get in with the route. The bands were Jewel 2 and Aero uh, for Reki, and then Jewel 5 and GT4 for Strong Sage. Meaning we'll be going for Jewel 4, Jewel 1, and uh, Jewel 3. Reki's been pretty consistent with banning out Aero and. Uh, tots versus players that have disproportionate amounts of experience on them. Reki holding his own here and keeping a hold of stack on Jewel 4 is really difficult. In control doesn't mean that much. Um, we've got two ways and a two minute mega and that's it. Uh, so the fact that he's on 200 armor right now, the fact that he still has almost 100 HP... Things are going very well for Reki right now. Reki. Having to deny armor at this point. Up close with a shotgun. Could be dangerous up against Strong Sage. Rockets now from up on high, but no! Uh, what? Reki, you absolute legend. Why has he done that? Fantastic. Reki in great form right now. I didn't even know you could, RJ, but. Teaching us all. Yeah, Strong Sage is super young, man. 
And he's amazing at Quake Champions. I've been uh, watching his stream. Such a strong player. So much potential. Kind of exciting that we have a, a new crop of young, exceptionally good players. Absolutely the case, Christus. Um, the, the two players that are going to grow the most uh, across this league are going to be Strong Sage and Yup. Uh, both of them could absolutely be near favourites by the end of things. That was that, <clears throat> that was that was strange. It was good. Up the jump pad. This is Darrell. Recky finally with his snack whittled down. Slightly off his strong sage with the route. Would have made all the difference. Oh, and he will get on the board. Great shot. Seven and two. Jumps over to the YA. Drops onto a 50, I would imagine. No, chasing. Aggressively. LG though on the stairs. And yeah, strong sage is pretty scared of that. And I think for good reason. Now, what can he do? A little bit slow to run away. Dodge. Oh, that was quick thinking. And this guy's so new. He probably barely knows this map. And he's making plays like that. Of course, it doesn't matter if you get shot in the face. I really thought Strong Sage was stuck there. At, um, at LG and then I just get us all the way to the 50. Uh, the graphics match the game, Rob. Uh, such is the nature of working with a developer. Um, when you're, you're making these things. Reckon very low here. Mega and four. They're both going to show up for it. Strong Sage with the shotgun. Good trap. On the rail. Does have a decent amount of ammo. Oh, no way! I thought after he missed that rocket, Reki was going to be fine, but no. Pull it out. The shotgun. So huge on this map, but so is the rail. Wrong stage. He, he should get both way A. Reki, I think, pushes in here. Oh, looks for the rail. It doesn't go his way. Strong Sage now with the ammo. And things are flicked in a major way. But off the spawn, Reki with the shotgun. A couple of misses here from Strong Sage. Could be crucial. The LG comes out. Not that effective, though. And Reki! Ooh. He shimmies on by with the shotgun. And now off the spawn. Oh, what in the world was that? It looked like it should have done so much more damage than it did. And he's out of ammo now. But still, five rails. A lot of rockets as well. Direct. Absolutely what the doctor ordered. But oh, Strong Sage coming off the jump pad. Could have done so much more. I think Lucky is Recky to get away here. Big rail. That's uh, such a huge rail, actually. Because Reki needs YA. He will get it. But oh! 
not without losing his life and now off the spawn but strong sage feeling worried himself has to get away onto the 50 doesn't get onto the second 50 and now trying to defend a ya that's not coming up anytime soon but he gets wrecky i don't know how he got wrecky i don't know how he knew to shoot or what he was shooting at mega is up who's on it it's strong sage nine for nine but advantage to strong sage absolutely on the ya as well looking for the second it is up it's gonna go his way what can wrecky do not a lot by the looks of things. 10 to 9 now. Strong Sage taking a serious advantage right off the mark. Could have been the clincher there. A minute and a half. Reki is still in this. Needs to slowly, bit by bit, get some free damage. And then one big attack. Big shotgun shot. Something like that. But no, Strong Sage baits the wire. And now what? Time against Reki. I think this could be curtains. 175 armor on dual four. One so, so three. much to expect from Reki here. The Strong Sage is at 200 armor. Can play as defensively as he likes. LG coming out. The Rockets, okay, but not great, but they're good enough. Straight on to the way as well. Shotgun combo. Oh dear lord, strong sage. You're a bit of a monster, my friend. GG is cool. There we go. On what was Reki's first pick as well. Strong sage, the up and comer, the newbie. The doombringer, but not a newbie to arena FPS. Not at all, but we go to dual one. We go to the home of doombringer we go to for me the eponymous map Th this is what it's all about and we are going to see if he can keep it up up against one of the best in recce one of the most experienced in recce here we go Three, two, one, fight. on board a strong save he's going to be making his way over to the ground people love the bolter jump i never use it personally um, I feel like it's just as inconsistent as actually doing the movement. Strong Sage getting caught off the bat here. And Reki just puts him down with the trio of shotgun shots. Going down. LG out. Looking good. Look for the flick. Oh no. That was his last shotgun. As well. Sad times for Reki. He gets the better of him. And pretty decent amount of health to work with. He's up against the red, but the goblin. Oh dear lord. Oh dear lord. You love to see it. I'm a big Reki fan at this point. Um, as, a, as a person. As a player. And I'm especially a fan of a goblin. now oh vicious straight through that telly absolutely oh red it wreck it Recky! Calm down, son. Why are you using a shotgun at that range, son? What's... Okay. It's alright. He gets the frag. It's fine. It's golden. Bang. Great play from you earlier today, Lugia. Really, really strong. Really impressive. Your your LG today was wild. Ooh. 
Reiki looking so confident here. What? All right. Look at the flick of the wrist. He's on the red. Both way A's up here. Mega as well. Strong Sage in a great position here, actually. The damage. Oh, Reiki! Yes! Yes! Absolutely. More, please. The man plays the items less than he plays the weapons. And he plays the weapons beautifully. What in the... Who is this man? He's so different in tournament. When we're in. GG. Fair play. Recky. Dual one Recky is different. Um, he's strong. He's so strong. When he's in form, when he's in shape, just... Absolutely. One of the players that could win this entire event. Um, we got a dual three. Ooh, we got a dual three? I mean, I knew that, but now that I'm thinking about it, that's really tantalizing. I mean, this map is pretty swingy. It's pretty aim-based, in my opinion. Lots of sight lines. Rail is oppressively good. Uh, and Strong Sage can absolutely match Reki in that regard. And Reki doesn't have a huge amount of experience on dual three, because nobody does. Um... We will see. This is going to be something else. Let's get into it. It's Reki versus Strong Sage, our last map for the night. It's time. Three, two, one, fight. Bang. Strong Sage, not going to get away. Straight into the crosshair of Reki. Who, uh, look at the movement. Reggie doesn't have rail that doesn't really feel like he can push. Waits for Strong Sage to leave. Now it goes to collect, and that's his full arsenal now. Can hold, I think, almost anywhere he wants. Just get on this mega. Hit that, because, I mean, why not? Could spread himself too thin here. It depends. He's going to play the sound, but yeah, it gives away mega in the process. Not ideal there for Reki. Um, still, obviously, huge armor stack, but. Yeah, Strong Sage, oh. He, he utilized the unused part of the map, the, the sort of upper area, very well. Made it uh, made it a little bit ambiguous for Reki about which item he was going to go for. Does get a major out of it, but you can see immediately, I mean, Reki's right back on it. And he's even cycling the green armor. He's even cycling the green armor. I don't even know what green armors are. I, I, I pay so little attention to them. I genuinely couldn't tell you where the green is on any map. I'll turn this car around right now. Honey. You're not going to Thought Park this year. I'm sorry. Reki does that. He gets really annoyed, right? When we play Duel 2, and I just rush rail off spawn, and then like I'll, I'll fight in the red pit. And yet he goes to fights like that, where he is so certain he will hit the hit scan. And then he has the gall to complain about me. Unbelievable. He's looking so good right now, the 100-200. Just hit scan spamming. Gives the Mega away again. Slightly questionable. J just, just hit everything. Yeah, just hit everything. 
Spirit and Signets in the chat. Talk to me. Does this uh, worry you a little bit? Uh, I hadn't thought about it that way. You know the crazy thing, Rob? This entire game, like, all of it visually was made by one man. The 3D, uh, the models, the animation, the art on the map, all of it, one man. Looking rather confident right now. I don't really see a reason for him to drop a frag here. Looking rock solid. So, I mean, when you're doing stuff like that, just careening towards your enemy with a rail out with only one slug, and you walk away like it's nothing. Uh, safe to say you're having a pretty good game. Now playing around this pillar, a couple of shotgun shots, even if he's missing. So hard for Strong Sage to get back in this game. Jewel 3 is brutal at times. Oh, he misses, though. This could be an opportunity, Strong Sage, on the board. Now, 1 to 11. What can he do? He's going to be immediately on the way. Eh? Now, looking towards the red. It is what's up next. Needs damage here. And this is the thing. Strong Sage needs things to go very well from now on. It's not just a case of being in control and eking out a frag here or there. He can't really be taking too much damage. He can't be slow in his advance hit. Up against the shotgun, pretty scary. Gonna go over the top. Big damage. Misses Rao though, and Reki hits his. And now coming forward with a shotgun, but no! Two beautiful rockets from Strong Sage. Keep him in it. Keep him in it 100%. Good shot. If he gets shot here though, he's. Oh! On to the 50, surely. Oh, he needs to get on the 50. Does he not know where the 50 is? No! Recky. Recky, 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 Recky. On the Mega. Oh, the opportunity there. Mio. Great shots as well. And this is what could well be the final nail in the coffin. Off spawn. Strong Sage going to have a tough time. Caught by that rail as well. Recky back on the warpath. Click, click. Oh! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Doombringer, ladies and gents. Doombringer. bring a bingo all over again. Jumping in is Recky with the LG. Couple of shotgun shots and it's going to be the crater. Strong Sage trying to just get to the rail. Didn't hit. Didn't hit again. Gets put down and I do believe that that is all she wrote. As Recky would have a hard time throwing this one. What a player. He showed up today. 
two zeros go. He's gonna two zero strong sage as well. Racky plays a beautiful game of Doombringer. Um, genuinely, if we're talking about, you know, towards the end, when Yup's really good, when Strong Sage is really good, when Cygnus and Zorak are obviously both incredibly good, Stink Light Sock, we'll see what he's made of, could well be a force to be reckoned with. Should be. Uh, if history is anything to go by, Respa still in the mix. But I tell you, I think Racky, uh, apart from Zorak Core, of course, we always have to sort of separate him. I think Reki is absolutely as good as any of them on his day. And he's showing him up right now. Sage took the first map. I might. Oh, he did? What, what is wrong with me? This is map three. Don't worry. Joel's an idiot. He can't remember anything. He spent all day in hospital. Okay, you got to feel bad for me. Who won though? Still. Impressive stuff from Raki. And it is going to be a story going forward. Can Raki maintain his tournament form? Can he play up to his ability? All right, that's a that's a nice way of saying goodbye. I think Strong Sage does get on the board a couple of times, and actually 19 to 10. This isn't too far gone. Um, if it if it weren't for the fact that there are zero seconds remaining, but there we go, Recky two for one in the series. Uh, beautifully played, beautifully played, fantastic on Jewel three, fantastic on Jewel one. Strong Sage though, this guy's still so scary, and I think in the long run absolutely someone we need to be keeping our eyes out of he could take on the likes of Zorik, the likes of Cygnus he's going to be able to take Reki soon enough um there we go that was Doombring and Jewel League week two we uh we are gonna have more stuff next week more matches and I will be uploading the results to the challenge now um so you can have a look at exactly what the league standings are like but that is our show uh I'm just gonna say a few things about Doombringer itself um exclamation point doombringer in the chat you can go by the single player it does support events like this and the game in general uh you're going to be able to go to the website doombringer.eu as well and have a look there doombringer dual league will return next friday at 9 p.m cet as always for the foreseeable uh there are other things on tim conlon um we've got some diabolical race stuff the egg cup that's all coming up you know where to find it, I'm sure. It is going to be tomorrow at some time. 8 p.m. CET tomorrow. Um, so do tune in for that. Anyway, that is our show. Thank you ever so much for watching. Do hope you enjoyed. And we will see you next week. Bye-bye for now.